Let's see if I can get this magic of... We're just going to pretend that didn't happen. We're just going to pretend that didn't happen. Uh, the magic of video editing. Hmm. You know, when it's when all black screen, it's kind of hard to tell what all am I capturing here. Ah, okay, okay. I think everything... Well, we can see the Konami stuff now. I think everything's in frame. But yeah, yeah. Technical difficulties. Forget about it. We're just gonna... Let's do this, let's do this. Alright guys, welcome to my new Let's Play. Here we go guys. New Let's Play on the channel. This is Legendly Yu-Gi-Oh! Egyptian Tooling by me, Fudma This is Let's Play Yu Gi Oh! Forbidden Memories, and it's a new Let's Play, so let's hit new game. And we'll put in our name as. Oops. <laughs> nope, don't want to do that. E, no, no, no. We want to go. Y'all know the name, F. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, D. Fudma. Videos, videos, videos. Your name is Flood 4. Yeah, 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 that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Can't go or trade with Senko. Eh, no biggie. Alrighty. Let's see if this will work so I can. Oh, I hear the footsteps. Ah, the footsteps are a good sign. Alright, and now for my, uh, uh my, uh, villain voice this time. Proper. Ah, this is it! <laughs> I found it at last, my Bunkai! <laughs> and I've edited it to, to inflict a new type of poison. Ah, you Quincy fool! The forbidden treasure of the ancient sorcerers! <laughs> right at my fingertips! Everything's laid out for me! Yes! <laughs> my only quantity! <laughs> and once again, this is Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! Orbit Memories by me. Pokemon 14, uh, that classic jingle. Alright, so last time we, uh, well, uh, my dear Prince, are you going out to the city and play cards again? You are royal blood, walking the city streets dressed as a cop. Sounds like a Disney tale, you know? <laughs> Why is this guy blue? What? Uh, have you no shame? Quite frankly, I'm embarrassed. This guy like an alien or something? Uh, run away. What? Wait! Stop! My prince! What are you doing? Drat! He's gone. Alright, so last time, um, yeah, you might, guys may be like, what, last time? This is episode one. <laughs> no, 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 no. Last time, we had, uh, <laughs> technical difficulties, which is kind of, it, it all turned out, hello there. Oh, don't save, Josh, don't save, don't save. So last time, it actually turned out all okay. We're just gonna, uh, oops, didn't mean to do that. We actually want to return the title. Uh, because despite all of the technical difficulties, which you guys are going to see in the next episode, it's, it's going to be a bonus episode. Just, just trust me, trust me. Uh, but we're going to start out clean like this. Uh, so let's return to title. Yes. And then we're going to load the... Uh, yep, go back. We're going to load the save we made. Uh, yes, because we had some very, very good cards. So, Campagna. Oh, I'm sorry, campaign. And I have no idea what, you know, the other starter deck we got just now. I didn't even bother to check it, but... So, if you go to, uh, yeah, this is you, Let's Play you Gale Forbidden Memories. I'm going to pretend like, you know, you guys haven't seen anything. Because you haven't. So, if we go to build deck, we can check out our deck. And uh, you'll see that we got some pretty cool stuff. Uh, we actually checked it out in the bonus episode. But <laughs> Blackland Fire Dragon, 1500. Pretty good in this game to start with. Pretty good. Mask of Darkness. Uh, yeah, just, just a look at our deck here. Uh, some, some, like the, uh, okay, so like the symbols right there, like you see the symbol with the sword and the symbol with like, kind of like a stone right here. That is what really matters in this game. Uh, the tights. Uh, much like Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelist of the Roses, 
certain types confused with other types. This is also a pretty good card. Uh, this destroys every card on the field, not just monsters in this game, so kind of different. This powers up our dragons. Pretty good. You know, kind of like the field cards in uh, Ulster Roses, but this game is actually... It's more of a in a boat of its own because some of the fusions, some fusions in this game, and some and yes, you can fuse in this game, much like in Duels of the Roses, because Duels of the Roses is, is uh, the successor to this game because it's called Succeeded Memories, whereas this is Forbidden Memories. And in Japan, it's called Yu-Gi-Oh! Succeeded Memories or Shin Duel Monsters 2: Succeeded Memories. Uh, but, but but enough about gameplay. Long story short, we got a really good deck. We're gonna keep it. Uh, you, you guys will see in the bonus episode. Let's pretend none of that happened. And let's just leave it. Oh, I need to keep an eye on the time. So it's 7.29. Okay, I'm going to stop at like 7.50. I think we can get a, about a 25-minute episode. So let's leave shop. And, you know, now that we've uh, done that, let's just kind of mosey around here. Let's go to the shrine. What is this? What is this? Hmm. We don't know what day. Ooh, that looks ominous as... These hallowed halls are protected by High Mage High Shin. Commoners are not allowed. Commoner? What? Be gone with you. Oh, right. I'm, uh, I'm incognito. I'm in disguise. Right, because Simon said, you know, dressing as a commoner, yada, yada. Uh, well, we don't want to go to the dual ground yet. Let's check out the time plaza. Let's see what's going on here. Lots of people are gathered at the town plaza. But there's nothing of interest. Hmm. Long story short, that's the game's way of telling you, eh, proceed to event uh, X to uh, proceed the game. So where you actually need to go is not the cart shop, but I am kind of glad I went here so we can save real quick. Because uh, I don't want to see, you know, multiple cutscenes. Uh, and there is a chance we could game over here, so, uh, it's actually a very good thing I saved. Yeah, believe it or not, yeah, you could game over. Uh, by the way, when you lose in this game, you game over. Where you need to go is the dual ground. By the way, I like the, man, you see, like, the, uh, the, like, the lettering, or I don't know what you'd call that, behind the dual ground, like, everything in this game looks so cool, man. Hi, I've been waiting for you, Flood and Mind 14. Friendship is so important. Uh, looks, this person looks just like Taya, but is she Taya? Jonah was here a few minutes ago. Jonah? What? But he's gone now. Friendship will help me get through this time. How about a duel? Uh, so we can talk to someone else, go outside. But let's humor her. Let's just duel. Okay, let's play. Hope you're not a sore loser. That's right. Let's play. Let's play Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. We're doing it right now. So, uh, this is our trunk. If we had extra cards, we could, you know, kind of mess with the cards in our deck. You know, take the bad cards out, put the good ones in. But, you know, you're starting deck. You're just gonna have what you have. So... Uh, my advice for this game, this game can be pretty hard, you know, amongst the first, uh, five or six duels. My advice is, like, even if you're familiar with this game from, um, uh, Duels of the Roses or whatever, even if you're not, just try anything, like, literally, try anything. Like, I'm gonna try Violet Crystal in this. This says it should only work on zombies, but... Weird things can happen in this game, so... Yeah, yeah, so yeah, and it worked on Mask of Darkness, and, uh... Also, you have a Guardian Star. Uh, certain, uh... Stars? A Shadow Mask created by the hands of a Dark Mage. Yeah, so, like, this card is a Fiend, as you can see up there at the top. So, uh, according to the description on Violet Crystal, it only works on zombies, so this shouldn't have worked. But it did. Anyway, we need to press Start in our turn. Can't stop from the first turn. That's still the same, but a lot of things are different in this game. You guys will see what I mean. Uh, so let's try something else. Let's try a lamp and a spellcaster. This might make something? Ah! Lord of the Lamb! Nice. So let's go with Saturn uh, from the Garden Star, because you have Mercury. And let's just try attacking with Master of Darkness. If you press a uh, square, you will get a little 3D battle. So, oh, and there's the Mystic Lamp. Hey, hopefully we can win that from uh, this person. Anyway. All right. La Mask. We all wear masks. 
metaphorically speaking. Oh, me tuna. A mark tuna. Oh, man. You ain't never had a friend. Never had a friend. You ain't. Okay. Let me. Let me. Oh, just kind of, uh. Yeah. Just kind of psychically blasted him there. That was cool. What do you got, mask? Oh, ho, ho. evil laugh. <laughs> Maniacal laugh. So, yeah, that's what, uh. Uh, battles look like. I'm not going to be showing like every single battle, but uh, I'll show some here and there. Uh, but yeah, it's in the turn. But yeah, this game's pretty fun. It takes some getting used to, but yeah, long story short, if you didn't start out with a really good deck or whatever, just try everything. Try, like, for example, try, like, you wouldn't think this beast and this thunder goes together, but just try it. Just try weird stuff. And sometimes, hey, tripwire beast. That kind of makes sense. Also, like, try summoning stuff with different signs. Because sometimes you'll get, like, a super effective, uh, if you your sign is super effective against there. It's kind of like Pokemon types. If your Guardian Star is super effective against theirs, you'll gain 500. If your Guardian Star is weak against uh, the opponent's monster, you'll lose 500. So, if you can't figure out fusions, uh, write them down if you have to, you know, whatever. Oh man, this thing looks like kind of like Snorlax, but that. It looks like five Millennium Eyes. Did we find five Millennium Items? No, 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 but seriously. Thunder Shock! Uh, that actually looks really cool. Wow. But yeah, as I was saying, if your fusions keep failing, uh, write down what does work, you know, try to remember it. You know, but if it doesn't, just try putting uh, summoning different things with different Guardian Stars. Uh, if you have to, write down, like, you know, kind of a type chart of what star is good against what, and then, uh, yeah, just try to go from there. What's going on here? Oh man, did my game freeze? It's like stuck. Oh man, I was saying we were going to have technical difficulties twice. Uh, circle? Oh no. We, we were winning that duel. Hey, good thing I saved before doing this duel, huh? Frozen. Oh, technical difficulties again? Alright, alright. Well, um, I guess we'll end it here, and I'll talk more about how the duels work next time. Uh, basically, next time we're just gonna start with Duel Taya, and I'm not gonna show any battles. We're just gonna, we're just gonna go. We're just gonna go. Okay. Bye, guys. Wow, weird. Three technical difficulties in a row. Probably look for another uh, CD, like on, on Amazon or something. Mm. Bye, guys.